Oh no. <laughs> okay, so um, here I am again. I try to pull Sarah in. Okay, here we go. I see her. Hey. Oh my gosh. We got it to work. I <laughs> Yeah, um, yeah. I don't know what was going on. I was like, I'm, I'm here. Uh, let me join. Let me join. But I'm glad you. I'm glad we figured it out. I know. It's like, oh my gosh, we tested this yesterday. <laughs> I know. I was like, this is why we test. It's all good. We got it to work. We're good. Now we're in business. Um, first, first, first of all, is today your birthday? Actually, it's the it's Monday, the thirty first. Why is Facebook saying that it's your birthday? <laughs> Because um, I was doing a celebration, you know. Uh, the oh, it's a week. It's a week long thing. Yeah. You know? <laughs> so, so, um, well, happy early birthday. Thank you. <laughs> I was so confused. I was like, is it the 29th? And then Facebook and then people are wishing you. I know my mom, you know, wish you a happy birthday. I was just like, what's going on? No, but OK, not, cool. Not the flyer. It says birthday celebration and launch. <laughs> Got you. Yeah, okay. It's okay. Today, but it's, well, it's a week long thing. Yeah. Okay. Um, so. Yeah. So, how how are you feeling? First of all. Well, I'm. You know what it is. <laughs> you know, I'm feeling. I'm comfortable, but the the climate. You know, everything that's going on, right? Is like it's forcing me to go in, and all this stuff mm -hmm. is coming out. So, mm -hmm. on one hand, I'm great. On the other hand, it's like, all this stuff, all this self work is coming out, you know? So, yeah. it's hard to be yeah. like, I'm great. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Because it's a lot of no, that's work. It's forcing me to do a lot yeah. of work. Yeah. No, that's that's valid. That's valid. Um, I'm looking at you and I can't see your face. Oh, you can um, see my face? No. I don't know if that's the same for all the other people who are viewing. Oh. Um, if you want to tilt the, yeah, there we go. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. Oh, great. Okay. And so how are you doing in this climate? Yeah, I, um, I'm not, I would be lying if I said I was okay. Um, I feel things very deeply. So I don't think anyone in 2020 is doing okay. Um, except for people who just don't care about anybody else. Right. Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm, I don't, I'm not okay, but I'm holding on to, uh, you know, the things that help me be okay, like love, like, um, empathy, mm -hmm. like, um, faith, mm -hmm. you know, all these things, all these pillars that, that help me be okay i'm really holding on to them in 2020 because okay. <laughs> if you don't i just think that um you know it's kind of it's really hard to kind of push through um right, right and you know the year has been a the year has been a battle i was i was uh you know so shaken by the news of like chadwick boseman um yesterday and it's you know you you don't um uh, you don't know these people personally, but they affect you in a personal way. Yeah. And, um, and yeah, so yeah, that's the long answer to your question, but I'm the one asking the questions today. <laughs> <This> is, <laughs> um, let me know when you want to, when you want to like start, or if you want to wait a little bit, you let me know. I'll follow your lead. Okay. So, um, we can start with, um, our history. So, uh... let's start. Um, I mean, first of all, like, I know that, like we just talked about, how the year is is crazy. Mm -hmm. One thing I'm looking forward to is your fall 2020 collection. Mm -hmm. um, I know that you've been hard at work on it. Mm -hmm. So yeah, just tell me a little bit about um, this collection and what 
what makes it, you know, unique, if you had to say? Okay, so, um, well, first of all, I wanted to say that Sarah and I have had history. We worked together before. <laughs> oh, 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 my bad, my bad, my bad. I thought you meant the history of your company, not like our history. Yes, yes. <laughs> so we did, um, well, I, Tumba Tumba Design also has a project called Tumba Tumba Apparel for the Soul. Mm -hmm. so it's a woman empowerment. So we did a forum at Fordham University, and Sarah was one of the panelists, right? Yes, <laughs> Sarah yes, was I was. A filmmaker, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. And so she was featuring her film, talking about her film, and um, we also did an event at NYU, in which uh, Sarah was a guest speaker. She was the only speaker at NYU, and um, mm. she was talking about her project, um, Maybe Well, right? Yeah, about mental health in the black community. Yeah. Right, right. Right. So that that is our history and I know Sarah's mom and everything. We're both from the Congo. We <laughs> we, we met <laughs> all right in our activism, right? We was it friends of the Congo where we met. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I mean we just we just go way back and you've always used your platform to kind of uplift the work that I do, but just like the work that anyone who is uplifting Congo or women, I feel like that's kind of like a, a constant trait with you. And uh, I'm certainly very appreciative of it because you clearly put a lot of effort and time into the, the things that matter to you. And um, so, so yeah, I, I'm grateful for your friendship. I'm grateful that your my mom knows you and loves you. <laughs> and uh, and yeah, so I'm glad to be, you know, in conversation with you today. So, um, so yeah, so that's the history. <laughs> now we can talk about um, you and, and this collection and all these things that I, that I just want to learn more about. So we said fall 2020. Yeah. Um, I'm really looking forward to it because, like we established, this year has been wild. Yeah. But um, you've been you've been hard at work, you know, putting together this collection. So I just want to know, like, what. What uh, is special about it? What makes it unique to you? Okay, so what makes it unique to me is, is just accessories. Um, I never focus just on accessories. And, and it is also for this climate. So it's something to embellish you while, you know, we are, we do have to eat, we have to go grocery shopping, right? So yeah, we have to yeah. go up, right? So these, um, they're, they're bandanas, right? And you can use them mm -hmm. to cover your head, right? And I'm wearing mm -hmm. a neck piece right now. Oh, nice. Okay. You can hold your fro, right? Yeah, I'm going to need one. <laughs> okay, nice. <laughs> right. So you can hold your fro. And they're very embellished, so you, you want to wear it. You want to feel good about it, you know? Mm -hmm. And uh, we also have the, um, the more culture one. Let me just show that one to you. Yeah, love to see it. <laughs> I have to turn my thing around. I have this new, this is a new phone, so I don't really know how to work it yet. It's all good. Take your time. Take your time. <laughs> oh, that's, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Right? So it's... Um, yeah, that's really cool. Right? So um, I call that one um, Black Lives Matter. <laughs> mm. Cultural when you want mm -hmm. cultural. Um, yeah. So there's... Um, of course, a lot more up on the website, mm -hmm. tumbatumba.com. Okay, can you see me? Yeah, I can see you now. Yeah, you you were frozen for a second, but uh, I'm going to see you now. Hold on. I want to share this video with, with my friends as well so that, you know, if anybody's on right now, they can just pop in. So give me one second, okay?
interviewing my sister about her amazing collection. Tune in now. That's what I'm going to put. <laughs> Um, sorry about that. I just want to make sure we, we get the word out. Um, yeah, no, I, I love that. I love that the um, the accessories, like you said, are um, kind of inspired or affected by this climate. Um, so I kind of just want you to tell me a little bit more about that, like the, the inspiration behind the designs um, and the things that you that you've put together for this color. Hey, I don't know what happened. I lost you. <laughs> no, I don't know what happened either. Yeah. Um, yeah, I couldn't hear you after a while, and then it just logged me out. Um, so, yeah, so you were saying that, um, you know, you're being a Christian, you being rooted in your faith um, has greatly impacted the work that you do um, and how these designs come to life. And I think that's really, really powerful. So can you just uh, pick up pick up on that before? Because um, um, I think we got disconnected, so I want to make sure that people uh, people hear that. Okay, so just kind of review it a bit. Yeah, review it just a little bit, like, and because I think that's so profound. You know, um, we I feel like that's how you live a purposeful 
life when you um, are moving, you know, basically being led by the spirit, led by these things that you mentioned about love and, and things like that. So just explain to me a little bit about how, um, you know, how these designs come to life through you. actually what's what's inside what's inside of us right so it mm -hmm. comes through the, the clothing so you know as i was saying um coming from a full space being love already being like jesus um and remembering that right it, it comes through the clothes right from um uh because of the colors that i'm using right is reflecting um everything that i already am or that we already are inside from a full space as opposed to from a place of lacking where you have to try to be like him we already are like him and we just have to take the steps to remember that and that's love peace joy courage all of those um wonderful characteristics that he has we already are and that's what's inspiring um the colors or the, even the, the patterns of the clothes. Um, as you can see, I, I use a lot of um, circle patterns. So that's, a, a, for me, it symbolizes um, yeah. one piece with God. Yeah. Can you show me the piece that you called Black Lives Matter again? Can you show it to me for, yes, yeah, so that the people who are just tuning in can kind of have a better understanding of um, what you mean by color and, and you know, the, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's I think that's really beautiful, and um, I kind of want to know what does Black Lives Matter mean to you? Okay, to me, um, so Black Lives Matter is is a movement of the people. I know uh, the this is an organization that started it, and you know everybody's hearing different things about the organization itself, but. For me, it's, it's a movement of the people. And now all of um, different cultures worldwide are joining in this movement of unity of the people. I know specifically for us, it's, it's, it's hap something's happening to us, mm -hmm. but I think it's a movement to unify all of us, the whole mm -hmm. world. I think in this time, 2020, I know it seems negative or whatever, but I think it's also unifying us. I mean, at one time, I even saw, um, they, I think they were Amish in their clothes, and mm -hmm. they're Amish clothing with, with Black Lives Matter mm -hmm. signs. Mm -hmm. I was so moved, you know. Yeah. I, I get moved, like, <laughs> easy, you know. Yeah, me too, me too. Don't worry about <laughs> it. <laughs> no, that, that, that's really... Um, powerful to say i mean unity is important and i just love when artists creatives like yourself are able to bring this to the work that they do you know i think there's there's a beauty in that um there's like um there's a genius in that right to be able to like take what's going on around us and to make art out of it i'm so moved and inspired by people like you you know I think that's so cool um, that you're able to do that. I mean, I try to do it in, in, in my work too, but seeing someone like yourself kind of bring these ideas to life through um, something that I'm going to be able to wear, I think is just really powerful. Um, that's really cool. So, so is there a particular cause? I mean, we're kind of talking about it already. I know you're really into, you know, gender empowerment, and that's like a platform that you really um, push towards. Is there anything um, else, you know, any other cause? specifically talking about this fall 2020 collection that you are um, supporting. Obviously, we just talked about Black Lives Matter and just unity, but is there anything else that you're really pushing for with this collection? Okay, for this collection specifically, um, I mean, in general, uh, my uh, company focuses on women uh, empowerment, right? And that's because the um, fashion design industry is already like so um, it kind of shrinks women you know so women are getting all these um, trying to they, they're, a lot of women in the fashion industry get you know operations Botox and just to stay to the standard of um, being a model you know or what's the standard in, out there for, to be a model so mm -hmm. they're getting this and this and that and that or um, they're told that, like, curvy women are told, you know, which is changing now, right? 
slowly, s- slowly <laughs> changing. But yeah, yeah. Yeah, curvy women are told, you know, you, you're too fat. You know, you're too fat to model. You're too, you know? So basically, we started off with, with um, women empowerment and letting women know that we're focusing on um, the spirit of women. And we do want all types of women um, to model our clothes as well. Um, so, so in general is basically to empower women and, um, keep their self-esteem up because it does affect the self-esteem. The fashion industry affects the, I mean, yeah, the fashion industry really affects the, uh, the self-esteem in so many, many ways for women. Um, cause if we look back at Marilyn Monroe, you know, that standard, that's, that's a real size woman, right? Mm. <laughs> right. So, so now it's like, it's, sh- it's like shrinking women. So now, um, that's why the company is focusing on women's spirit and all types of women. And adding on to 2020, <laughs> adding on to 2020 is, is focusing on um, the character of, of unity, courage mm-hmm. as well. You know, um, just being, we really need to, to stick together at this point as humanity because of what's, what's going on. It's, it's layered and layered and layered <laughs> on top yeah. of layered. Yeah. So Absolutely. Humanity, stick together, empathy, and um, so that's why there's also a Black Lives Matter <laughs> accessory. Yeah. 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 No, that like I said, I think it's really um, powerful to be able to take everything that's going on and create art out of it. And um, you constantly center women in your work. I just wanted to know, like, what um, what has impacted your view of womanhood? Like, what does womanhood mean to you and how is that shaped or cultivated? You know, um, I'm just interested to know what your, what your idea of womanhood is. Okay, so womanhood, well, growing up um, Congolese, <laughs> yeah. even, though, even though I grew up here, um, just your, your parents, what your parents teach you in our culture is basically, we're, we're like second class citizens, basically. So, yeah, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> that's what impacted me to make a difference mm-hmm. you know um because there are um situations where um the husband could discipline the the wife like a, a child like his mm-hmm. child you know? yeah and um uh, and that just impacted me a, a great deal and mm-hmm. i'm like well i, I want to be in a space oh i want other women to be also in a space where they don't have to be defined by what society thinks of them yeah. You know, being a woman is being your own person. You don't have to be um, the stereotype or what you're supposed to be as mm-hmm. a woman. Um, just create this woman that you want to be. That's what being a, a woman means to me. Ooh. <laughs> I love that. I love that because I feel like um, that's really important. And I feel like a lot of young women particularly need to hear that too. So I love that you're doing that work and kind of, um, you know, inspiring us and uplifting us in the process. Uh, I guess the last question is like, when, um, what's the next event for Tumba and Tumba Designs? Um, are you, um, I mean, with everything that's going on, are you still planning things and, and at work trying to make things happen? Like what's, what's, what's next for you? Okay, so, um, so the next thing is, well, we, we started this, um, fashion week online Mm -hmm. and kind of slowed down. So it was, it was every season. Um, and it, it does focus on women's spirit. Mm -hmm. Um, so with, with, um, uh, fashion week online, right. Um, you wear a theme outfit, right? So say, uh, we're highlighting to, uh, on Wednesday, we're hiding, we're highlighting the spirit of women of joy. Right. Mm-hmm. So, okay. So for that day, you, you, you look retro. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. okay. So each day of the week has a theme and it, it, each day of the week has a, um, is highlighting the spirit of, of a woman. So okay. there's strength, courage, love, uh, I'm forgetting all of them, but, um, each day, it's, that, okay. um, it's not a pop quiz. Joy, courage, <laughs> love. Okay. Okay. Right. <laughs> okay. So each day there's, there's a dress up theme, right? So one day you dress up, um, 
um, like futuristic, mm-hmm. right? And um, another day you could dress up um, cultural, right? Okay. Okay, right. and so that, uh, so each and for cultural is um enlightenment, the spirit of a woman of enlightenment. Mm, okay. Right? Yeah. Um, so we're highlighting the spirit of a woman to let you know that it's the spirit of the woman that comes out into the clothes. So let's not focus so much on the external. Mm-hmm. So each day, um, each day has uh, um a day to to highlight the spirit of a woman. So we make that point. So that we can see, so that everybody can see that, okay, so it's the spirit of the woman. It's not focused so much on the physical aspect. Yeah, yeah. No, I like that it's going to be themed. Um, so how will people be able to kind of be a part of it just, just so that they um, have a better understanding? Like, are you going to just be posting it um, on, online? Like, how, how's it going to work? Okay, so it's, it's, it takes place on um, Facebook. And we, it is going to be on the website, Tumba mm-hmm. Tumba Design. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm sorry, Tumba Tumba.com. Mm-hmm. And then um, the Facebook also is Tumba Tumba Design. So there's all, all the information you need. Great. You, you look it up on the website or on Facebook. And it tells you step by step. It's like three steps. And you post, you can post yourself in different, you know, and yeah. <laughs> different theme clothing. And then we also post, um, our new designs and yeah. on theme on the day of the theme or the theme of the day, right? Yeah, yeah. No, I love so, that. Yeah. So I mean, and, yeah, go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Oh, that's good. So then we also had um, inspiration, women, inspirational women um, that have accepted to be our inspiration for for each theme, mm-hmm. um, courage, and we we had um, wow, we had a lot of people. Over there. We had um. Oh my gosh, I'm forgetting all of them. <laughs> it's okay, you can, you can post them, you, can, you know, you can post them later. But do you know who the woman is for Joy? Oh, for Joy. Um, no, we didn't have, we didn't have a particular woman, but yeah. there was some. Yeah, um, I'm honing in on that because, like, we started on this call, like, people really need Joy right now. Um, you know, because of everything that's been going on. Um, I guess the last question I'll ask you, I know I, I know, I said the previous question was the last one, but this is the actual last one. Um, what, um, what are you doing to cultivate joy? Like, how do you cultivate joy right now um, through the work that you're doing, through who you are in the community? How are you cultivating joy right now? Uh, joy is um, self-care first. Um, I, I meditate, right? And I also, on my free time, I listen to different DJs. I don't know if you heard of um, Rich Medina. Yeah. And of, course, <laughs> and of course, who? DJ D Nice. He's so popular. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, music is a music is a very important part of my self care uh, yeah. routine or process or whatever. So yeah, absolutely. But keep going. Yeah, and um, I do yoga, you know, movements. Um, I watch movies. So I do um, movement, stillness, um, and um, music. Mm-hmm. Music, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what helps you kind of cultivate joy. Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, well, it looks like the, the collection is going to bring forth a lot of these positive um feelings that we're trying to hold on to. I'm actually eager to see what each of the, you know, what each of the themes, how each of the themes will be expressed. You know, like you said, joy, courage, love. So I'm eager to see that. Um, is there anything else you want to talk about? I feel like uh, we, we covered, you know, a few things, but is there anything else you want to, is there anything I didn't ask you that you wish I would have asked you? <laughs> no, you actually <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, she did a good job. <laughs> I mean, listen, you know, I have a little, like a little bit of experience, just a little bit. So, um, no, that's cool. Well, look, I'm, I'm glad we got to chat. Um, and, yeah. Uh, and yeah, you know, good luck with the collection. Just the, 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 the few pieces that I saw, I think are really cool. Um, and uh, yeah, I, I wish you a successful launch. And I know that your birthday is in a couple of days. I'm wishing you a very happy and healthy birthday. Um, yeah. I know that, um, you know, the work that you do, a lot of it is not seen and heard on, you know, big platforms. So I'm just grateful for you, grateful for the work that you do, and uh, 
happy personal new year to you. Okay. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, you're welcome. All right. Much love. I'll talk to you soon. All right. Bye. Bye. So this is the women's. So again, the back part of this gender as well. So this is each one has a different sign. It's different words for this one that you have. So of course, if you ask for it ahead of time, uh, if you put in the order ahead of time, you can put in your request, all right? What color you want, all right? Um, so if I took it to the com, if you purchase one today, if you purchase one today, you can get 10% off, okay? So if you purchase one today, you can get another 10%. So if you purchase one today, you get 10% off. So the Black Lives Matter is $10. Um, the very embellished ones are $18. You purchase one today, you get 10% off, okay? All right, thank you for coming in. So, you guys, 